it's 6.30 in the morning and the sun is shining bright. Welcome to Daylight Savings. over here and say good morning I have my chrysanthemum tea in my hands which is kind of burning my hands right now but I just want to come on say good morning start this vlog welcome back to another vlog by the way if I'm looking a little bit shiny on my forehead and my shoulders it's because I just finished my skincare routine and I you know moisturize and put my little sunscreen oil on by the way just want to let you guys know sunscreen oil literally game changer like game freaking changer I just learned about sunscreen and putting it on. Actually, no, I didn't just learn. Like, I've always knew about... Hey, Alvin, what's up? I've always knew about sunscreen and putting it on every single day. But, I mean, don't hit the tripod. <laughs> but, I usually don't like putting it on because it's kind of like a lotion and, I don't know, it gets all pasty and I don't like the consistency of it. But, sunscreen oil, SPF oil, literally a game changer. It gets you all glowy, all nice looking and especially if you're going to the beach it gets you looking like all dewy and glowy it's amazing but now i'm just gonna drink my tea everybody's asleep so i gotta shh i'll talk to you guys later okay that's still a little bit hard mr thomas is up <laughs> he heard me <laughs> hello the sunshine you know who's another sunshine that one right there hello kitty pie good morning my little outfit for today <laughs> don't mind the background i'm washing the sheets so it's a little bit cray cray but if y'all are wondering this is my chilling around the house getting chores done doing you know things that needs to be done and this top is from collie the pants are from popville shop it's an instagram shop popville shop honestly you guys magenta pink like this pink has been really huge if you guys watched the milan fashion week paris fashion week london fashion week this pink is literally everywhere i think you know what i want to say valentino started it but i don't quite know i just know valentino had a huge magenta collection and i am literally obsessed i have like so many magenta things to think about like probably three months ago i didn't even own one pink item and now i have so many pink items because pink is in but yes this video later on a certain portion of this video is actually a collaboration with a makeup artist school it's called online makeup academy and you guys i think you guys oh my god you read from title i think i'm gonna title it this but i am going to be i haven't yet i haven't completed the course yet but once i complete the course i'm gonna be a certified makeup artist like i'm learning so much if you guys know me you know i don't know anything about makeup but i'm learning so freaking much and i'm so excited i'm gonna be a freaking certified makeup artist honestly it's it's nice to just add another certificate to your list of certificates, you know. You never know, one day you might just be like, hmm, let me try being a makeup artist and you already have the certificate for it. So I'll show you guys and talk to you guys further about that later. So another thing I want to talk to you guys about is actually, um, I don't know if you guys remember this, but about, I want to say two months back, a month, two months ago, I applied for a bunch of, like a few modeling agencies and about, I want to say three of them, three or four of them go back to me asking for more information, more pictures, like brands I've modeled for before and basically all my photo shoot pictures, etc. And I sent everything over to them. Long story short, coming to the final step of like face-to-face -face meetup, I ended up meeting up with one agency and honestly that was the agency that i really really wanted they didn't really get back to me until like way later on but um i ended up meeting up with the director face to face and having a good chat and everything like that and the thing is 
I'm not gonna say the name of the agency just yet because like I haven't officially signed with them all I'm waiting for at the moment is to get my visa because I can't legally work without my visa and obviously modeling and stuff like that would be working so I would need my visa so I'll keep you guys updated once I get my visa and sign with them but basically everything is looking good things are looking out I'm just gonna fingers crossed wait for my visa keep praying and believing that I'm gonna get my visa soon they told me to like um, drop them an email as soon as I get my visa and then we will go ahead from there but I just want to update you guys about that I'm really excited I think it might be this one but I need to do a test Tom questioning life right now why is he in Sephora well, how do you get himself into this situation <laughs> so I'm about to start getting ready for my photo shoot and we are going to talk about today's video collaboration this part of the video is a collaboration with online makeup academy basically they are online makeup school for makeup artists and they are based in New York City but because it's an online academy obviously people from all over the world can join the classes the one i'm doing is their master makeup artist course which at the end of it i'm going to be walking away with a omaca approved certificate of completion which is freaking amazing because if i wanted to be a makeup artist i could just go ahead and do it and just like get the experience after this i'll literally be a certified makeup artist so if you guys are interested in being a makeup artist getting certified or anything like that i'll talk further into it in details while we get ready so before that, I just want to talk real quick. This morning, I was telling you guys to remember about the body oil, like the SPF body oil, you guys. Literally, go and get yourself. If you guys like a glowy effect, glowy skin, go and get yourself SPF body oil and some SPF lotion. So this is the one that I'm using. I think you guys know this brand. I think everywhere sells this brand, but you don't have to get this brand specifically. It's just basically the sun care oil spf 30 high protection that's what i'm using i just like it's a spray form so i spray it all over my body and obviously i've already done my face i've already prepped my face so i'm not gonna redo it on top you need to like put your sunscreen on which by the way i also learned from this course you need to put your sunscreen on before anything and then let it sit let it sit through your skin and then you put your moisturizer and then let that be let that marinate in your skin for a bit before starting your makeup so i'm just gonna start off by moisturizing my face a little bit more because the moisturizer i did earlier have already sinked through so let's just you know give a little nice smooth surface to work on again more stuff I learned from the academy if you put makeup on a non-moisturized skin like it get it will end up getting all cakey and all weird especially me going out to shoot content for Instagram I can't afford to have like the weird flaky look on my face so I need to have a nice proper dewy look hence the moisturizer next up I'm going to go in with my color corrector which is the LA girl um pro concealer hd definition color corrector and okay here's the thing i feel like in a few videos ago i spoke about color corrector and i was saying like the one i use is orange is for dark circles and then the rest of them i don't know what exactly they do well now since i'm a makeup artist <laughs> I officially know what they actually do so basically the orange one this one right here covers blue anything with a blue surface so basically anything with veins it covers that and something i did not know actually is that your under eye circles are not black or brown they're blue they're actually like i think congested veins or something like that but basically they're like veins over there that's why they are darker on that area like blood vessels blood vessels veins so hence the darkness around the area so it's not actually like your skin pigmentation going dark i've also learned if you guys have rosacea which i just found out is what it's called basically you know how you have like pink red dots or i don't know if it's called like acne scars not really acne scars but it will work for acne scars as well or just anything that is um red like if your face gets very too rosy which gives you rosacea basically it's called to cover up that you'll use the mint color mint green color so as i told you guys earlier the one i'm doing right now is the master makeup artist course i've not completed it yet but i've done a fair bit and i've learned a lot basically they cover every single thing from sanitation to how to apply to what is for what skin and they cover like 
every skin type, every eye type, every face structure, every... Okay, I look really weird. I'm gonna put on my foundation while I talk. <laughs> so I don't look this weird right now. Even if you're not really looking to be a makeup artist, but you want to learn more about makeup and you just want to get really good at it, I would definitely recommend signing up for this. But anyway, I'm going in with my foundation right now. As you guys saw just now, I went to the store because I'm running out of foundation. And I got the Fenty. It's just that I haven't used my Fenty foundation in a while, so I completely forgot what shade I was using. I remember it was like a 4, 6 something. But when I went to the shop, the 4, 6 something looked really red on my skin. Maybe I grew lighter. I don't know. So um, she gave me the shade 4, 4, 5. But the girl at the store was so lovely, honestly. She put a little bit of tester into this little tube thing. And she said, like, don't open this just yet. Go back, try like doing a full face on this tube thing go out see it in different lightings and stuff and if you like it then open the packet but if you don't like it go in and return it for a different color and try out that color instead so obviously i'm gonna do it from here first hopefully it looks perfect because it did match perfectly with my neck so that's really good from my makeup class i learned that this brush is a foundation brush first of all which is correct because I'm using it for my foundation but apparently usually you know how I just like put foundation on my face and then proceed with putting the next thing on my face apparently this brush it should not be your last brush like for foundation this should be a foundation brush and then there's a different brush which I don't actually own that is supposed to be for like airbrush effect because apparently if you use this brush it will give like lines all over your face at the end of it which honestly I've noticed before but I didn't really like I thought that's just the way it rolls you know I didn't really know that it's not supposed to happen oh this color actually looks really good so back to the course the cost of the course is $899 that is including the course itself as well as a starter kit which contains a lot of things basically they have a whole like brushes range they have palettes they have um you know the little plate thing like the little palette thing where you put the product on and then apply it to people's face it comes with that as well and just a bunch of other stuff that it comes with so it's very very worth it and and I hooked you guys up big time. This is like the biggest money off saving collaboration I've ever done. If you guys use my code Janet Nimundele, $100 off, I'll put the code on the screen right here and in the description box below. As explanatory as the name is, you guys will get $100 off your whole course and everything if you're looking to do a makeup artist course i 100 percent recommend checking them down below or just like me if you're not looking to do a makeup artist course but you're really interested in like upping your makeup game which honestly i am i have been and i mean i spoke about it in multiple different videos i started buying stuff for my makeup kit because i wanted to like up my makeup game and this course is literally a game changer. Also, if you guys are not interested in the classic makeup artists, but you have different interests, they have every different category from special effects makeup course, face painting masterclass, body painting masterclass, bridal if I'm not mistaken, hairstyling course, and so much more. You guys can just scroll through their website. I'll put down their website link below, as I mentioned earlier, as well as my discount code. You guys can just scroll through and look through the list you might just find something that you absolutely love so i feel like with the discount code of hundred dollars it's a once in a lifetime opportunity so you might just want to check it out down below now i'm about to do my eyebrows and in the course that i'm doing they teach you everything from just a classic simple um no makeup makeup look all the way to like extravagant glam look so eyebrows are all done and now i'm gonna go in with my powder so you're supposed to use translucent powder for this but i only have this sort of loose powder which is fine too to be honest and because I'm doing a natural, like, dewy look, I'm trying to do a very simple, no makeup, makeup look. If you put powder, if you put powder all over your face, which I just learned, by the way, it gives it a very done up cake, not caked, but done up, like, airbrush look. And that's not what you want. You want to look more natural, right? So basically, I'm just going to go with the powder under my eyes, around my T-zone, around my nose area, and just around my mouth to set the foundation. And I'm not exactly going to do the top and the sides and everything because I want those to still look dewy and to still reflect off, you know, light. But 
I don't want to do it. I mean, I need to powder up certain area because obviously I'm going out to shoot in the sun. I don't want to look like I'm sweating out in town. Now it's time to go in with my bronzer, the bronzer that I'm using. It's the Benefit Bronzer Cakeless Concealer in the shade Work It. As I mentioned to you guys earlier, the course shows you like for different face shape, how to do your concealer, your highlight your eyes and everything like that like if you have eyes close together far apart almond shape droopy whatever different type of eyes or whatever face shapes that you have uh how to make it into the ideal shape so for my face i already apparently have the ideal shape so <laughs> Um, I just have to go in and do this like a number three basically the contour over here up here and then down to my jawline I'm gonna start over here put it up like that connect it as a number three I remember it I think it was my previous video I was doing my bronzer and I was like guys I literally don't know what I'm doing and I just start slapping on my cheek and blending it in but apparently I was supposed to be doing a number three just go in and blend that in with my foundation brush as well perfect and then and then you actually like anything that's a bit harsh line that you have not blend in you need to go through with an empty brush to kind of like blend it out but i don't have any clean brush empty brush i mean like clean brush i don't have any clean brush everything is for something and i haven't washed my brushes yet which you're meant to do every single day not for your personal use but as a makeup artist apparently you have to do it every single day but because it's my personal use you know i wash it like once a week i don't use it that often anyways one more thing that i actually really like about this online class is that just because it's online doesn't mean it's not interactive and it's not engaging because you would have your own personal tutor that you record your work you can send it to your tutor and they will send you back like personal feedbacks directly to you which i think is amazing because the second you sign up for the class your tutor will send you an email sending you like a, a, a recording email talking to you and telling you like you can send in your work to them anytime and so whenever you send it to them they'll send you back a video telling you what you did right or what you did wrong any questions you can just ask them that way which i think is freaking amazing because one thing that i always thought online studies was a bit hard is the the engagement part of things like the talking to your lecturer or instructor part of things but this one is really really good now i'm just gonna go in with my blush which is the benefit krista blush and also i just found out you're not supposed to put it apparently from here you're supposed to put it up here because over here looks a bit childish but over here is where it glows another thing about this course is that it's for a lifetime so basically if you pay right now you join right now or anytime you pay and join it's a lifetime course so every time they update new things like for example if um three years ago you signed up for this course and then the pandemic hit and now they have new um updated videos about like how to sanitize your stuff during covid and how to deal with situations and etc or in the future maybe something uh, a new makeup look comes out and they start making the, a video about that and you know uploading it to the course you guys will still have access to every single new content they upload so basically it's like a one-time subscription to your course now i'm just going in with my eyeliner which is the bys one day tattoo liquid eyeliner and i'm just going to do a very thin wing line and a fox eye in front try to create an almond eye look okay what do you think eyes is well not exactly done because i still gotta put on my mascara and the mascara that i'm gonna be using is actually new it's a pr product i haven't actually tried it on so i think this is the perfect time for me to try on and show you guys how it looks like it's from the company called lashes of change so this is how the mascara looks like it's so freaking gorgeous it's in this like rose gold packaging so it comes with two wands with two different heads personally the white one is my favorite because it has this like i don't know i just feel like the current mascara that i'm using this wand really helps make it very long and length elongate your lashes and uh, this one right here i might try this next time but today we're going to use this one right here oh yeah i freaking love this applicator you guys the one that i was previously using was the benefit um lash benefit like bang lash you guys know that that wand really gives you that full lift and this mascara has the exact same wand it comes with that one as an option obsessed look at the difference 
Look at that. Lashes are all done. A little more about Lashes of Change. They are an Australian brand. 25% of their profits go to breast cancer. The bottles are also reusable. They are refillable mascara, which is honestly a selling point. Now moving on to the final thing on my face. No, actually not final. I forgot to do my highlights. But my lips, <laughs> I'm just gonna go in with my Fenty CEO lipstick, which is like brownish, just nude colored lipstick. And now I'm gonna go in with my Fenty diamond milk I feel like every single thing I'm pulling on my Fenty Fenty my Fenty diamond milk lip gloss and just pop that right there perfect it's glowing can you guys even see that and then of course the final step I'm just gonna go in with my XXO cosmetic rose gold highlight and just highlight the top of my cheeks because we're doing a golden hour shoot and I need my cheeks to pop. Also you guys, I'm not gonna bring you with me for the shoot because we're gonna be shooting like in the middle of the road my, for like fashion pics, you know, my walking, my kind of pics. So obviously I'm not gonna bring y'all with me. I put my tripod in the middle of the streets, but you can head over to my Instagram, which is Janet Nemo Daily and check out all my fashion content on there. And the today's post will be over there as well. And the full look is done. I'm complete my glowy makeup look. Don't forget to check out Online Makeup Academy. The link is in the description box below as well as my discount code. Go and check it all out. I just got back from the gym. I had a shower and I had a little PR delivery. So I thought I want to show you guys what I got. It's from a company called... <laughs> Hold up just a second. It's from a company called Sister of Souls. By the way, if I look like I have zero energy, it's because I actually really do. Let me just brighten this up real quick. I'm not feeling well. I'm quite sick actually today. And I am exhausted because I just came back from the gym. I honestly did not feel like going, but I already had a PT session. So I couldn't leave my trainer hanging. But yeah. Anyway, they packaged it up so cute. But, um, so the first thing I got is, oh yeah, I completely forgot about this. This is the, I didn't know it's gonna be velvet. Hello. Oh, that is so cute. No, actually it's not velvet, it's suede. This is so cool. Okay, first of all, I picked it up because of the color. I thought it was gonna be leather, but suede? Hello, mama. This already made me happy. You see, my mood is like lifted up. I'm not feeling sick anymore. It even says like Wolfgang at the bottom here. I thought it was gonna be a lot bigger, but honestly, if you know me, you know that I only use small bags. I mean, if you follow me on Instagram, that's all I use. I literally, I love small bags. This is so pretty. Obsessed with the color. I have another bag actually coming in the mail from, I completely forgot what the name of the brand is, but from that brand. And it's the exact same color, not this type of bag though. It's like a very chic, hand carry, small. It's a funky shaped bag, but yeah, love this. Oh, this is so cute. You guys, look at that. They have a little note for me on this cute little butterfly paper. That is honestly so... I'm, I'm, you guys are probably gonna hear me say cute a lot in this video, but this is so cute! It says, Dear Janet, we hope you enjoy your new pieces. We look forward to seeing them on you. So the first piece we got, which if I'm honest, I don't remember picking this out. It's a long orange dress. I am positive I did not pick this out. But you know what? I'm gonna put it to the side. And it's so big too, I can't fit it. I'm gonna put this aside and send them a message telling them that this is not what I asked. Nah, actually that sounds a bit rude. I'll figure out how to say it like nicely because it's a PR, you know. You know what I mean? This is the next one. This is from the brand Wolfgang as well. And it's just this cute little halter neck top. I am literally in love with this. Like the second I saw it, it's so... Wait, hold on a second. Elvin is crying. Elvin! Come on, baby! Maybe. There's no one at home. I mean like Tom's upstairs, but like everybody else went out and Tom's brother is sleeping But everybody else went out and so This one right here starts crying when he doesn't see people around. Anyway, the next thing we have is Excuse me, mister You're sniffing my clothes. This one right here. Okay, this one. I know you, you guys are probably like Jen. That's a little bit funky 
that's what I thought too. I thought it's a little bit funky, but it's, I don't know, it just gives me 70s vibe. If you guys didn't know, I'm obsessed with like the 70s fashion, 70s vibe, like everything, most things in the 70s. I just love it. Like, especially when I have my fro out, I'm like, I'm a 70s queen. I feel like this is something the girls in ABBA would wear. It's so pretty. It's supposed to be not full length, so it doesn't go all the way down to your feet. I wish I can show you guys, but it doesn't go all the way down to your feet. It kind of stopped right above your ankle a little bit. And lastly, actually I asked for, I got like a few more stuff, but I don't see them here. So we're just gonna, I think there's another package coming because Tom told me sometimes when they do two parcels, they tend to get lost in the mail, like separated in the mail. And one comes first and one comes later. But I actually have shoes and the skirt for this one. It's a matching skirt for this one, which they did not send me. And this one, I think it's someone else's one, as I told you earlier, I think, the warehouse might have mistakenly put it in so I need to let them know and this is the final dress it's basically a little bit of a baby doll dress I sized up this is in size 8 I'd usually get a size 4 but this is in size 8 because I mean I didn't want it to be too short I can't wait to try it on but honestly I could not be bothered to try it on today because I'm having a massive headache so that's the outfits um, you know what, I was gonna like continue vlogging whatever I do today but I, I don't think I'm gonna be doing anything today or tomorrow or the day after because I've actually been pretty sick lately on and off and today it's just all come all coming down once together that didn't make any sense but you know what I mean it's all coming to together this morning I woke up I had like flu headache and just this area here was hurting my stomach I felt nauseous it's just like a whole big ass mess and on top of that the gym just pushed it all to the max but yeah anyways enough of me whining <laughs> can I just show you guys what Alvin's doing he's so freaking cute who is he waiting for? Alvin! Baby! Alvin! Alvin? Okay, he's just gonna ignore me now, but... Anyways, um, I'm gonna end the video here. Am I in focus? Okay, I'm gonna end the video over here. I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching my videos. I'll be posting more vlogs uh, soon. I know I took a little bit of a break because I genuinely needed it, but more vlogs will be coming back and more fun weekly vlogs will be coming back soon. I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching my videos. If you guys are interested again with the makeup course, don't forget to check it out. The link, well, let me put you down my armpits. <laughs> the link will be in the description box below as well as the coupon code and everything like that i love you guys so much and i'll see you in my next video Mwah. bye don't forget to follow me on instagram